Why do they even have you digging these holes? Planting seeds or something. <gasps> Maybe they're gonna bury you out here. <laughs> Greg, don't you want to be more like your brother? Just always doing what you're told? Huh? Just a pathetic pushover who relies on others to make all his decisions? Hey, what? I'm not a pushover. Hold on, Wirt. Let me get to my point. <sighs> Fine. See, Greg? No willpower whatsoever. Hmm. Um, Beatrice, why are you pretending I'm this guy's nephew? We need money. You're scamming him? I was thinking more like flat out stealing from him. What? No way. Why not? We already stole a horse. Hey, guys. No, we didn't. Fred's a talking horse. He can do whatever he wants. I want to steal. Oh, sorry, everybody. Sorry. No, he doesn't have a brain. He can't learn anything. Let's go, work. Come on. Here, boy. What? Did you say something? I, I can't hear you because I'm too busy doing what I'm told. What? What are you... No, no. Let's go. Oh, no. See, I'm a pushover. Remember? I have to do what she tells me to do. Oh. It's stuck. Well, guess we have to spend some quality time together. Hi! Bees for beloved that I called you. Ooh, that lady's got some baggage. What's that? Young man, go to the dance box. Oh, sure. Okay. No, no. Sure. Uh, no, no. Mm -hmm. oh. I have this crush on this girl. Mm -hmm. That's all. That's all? And I think about her a lot, and I play clarinet. Wirt, you gotta be kidding me. And I secretly whisper poetry to myself in my room at night. Where that stuff's not weird. Those are just, well, the poetry thing is weird. Hey. Does this room look different to you? Uh, how so? It's like French Rococo style. That doesn't really seem in line with Endicott's Georgian sensibilities. How? What? Who on earth am I talking to right now? Should I not know that sort of stuff? Okay, Wirt, I'll admit it. You seem like a pushover, but you're not. Oh? Deep down in your heart, you're a stubborn jerk. When are you gonna give this up? Maybe never. Maybe I'll never give this up. <laughs>